Gandhi War Committee celebrated the hosting of the Silver Jubilee Walk on March 28. They were partnered with the 1860 Legacy Foundation for the pre-launch of the Gauteng celebrations to mark the 150 years of Indians in South Africa. Over 3,000 walkers participated in the 7-kilometer and 15-kilometer walks. South Africa. This is how we celebrated the legacy of the great Mahatma. All skin colors, black, white, colored and Indian, marching together in the reenactment of a special event that would change a man and two nations 100 years ago. This was not possible in South Africa in 1908 during an era known as apartheid. Yet despite the life-threatening danger, Mahatma Gandhi, with some assistance, mobilized 3,000 Indian people and marched in peaceful protest. Gandhi would have been proud that the essence of active resistance and non-violence still resonates amongst the youth today. This uh, Gandhi walk, they thought that is a very, very good uh, occasion to launch their uh, walk because it's a multinational, multi-religious and it's open to the whole community and uh, Gandhi walk follow, follows the path of Gandhi which means no discrimination, just look at your goal and what you are trying to aim and Gandhi walk is trying to aim to get unity, peace and health for the community. Well, I think in respect of Mahatma Gandhi's ethical model and political leadership and his legacy, it's also a legacy that 150 years of, of Indian uh, arrival in this country, and there's a lot in common in terms of what Gandhi stood for and in terms of what the broader Indian community in this country stood for. Good news for small business. You will reach millions of viewers 24-7, anytime, anywhere, locally and internationally. Tell the world who you are, what you do and where you are. In just one click, we will produce your video and host it on BizLive Web. Let's get started today. Although the date is not exactly the same, it is the same month that the Mahatma did the Dandi march when he marched to a small village on the coast to make salt in defiance of what were then salt, prohibit salt, salt monopolies that the government, the British government ran. In doing that, he mobilized the community of Indians to march for a purpose. Of course, this is quite a different sort of atmosphere and a different purpose, but the essence of it is the same, the idea of mobilizing people to stand together irrespective of language, religion, uh, race, and that is the essence of creating a community. I found this event particularly significant because it symbolizes how far we have come in the past 25 years. This is, it's really incredible how, how Indians are walking with different races and doing the Gandhi walk, and which, which basically emphasizes on Rainbow Nation and all those ideals that Nelson Mandela um, wanted our country to have. The Gandhi Walk uh, and the 150th commemoration are of extreme significance to this community. Both capture the, the, the spirit and the memory and the contribution that Gandhi would have made or made to, to, to the history of this country and to the freedom of South Africa. Good news for small business. You will reach millions of viewers 24-7, anytime, anywhere, locally and internationally. Tell the world who you are, what you do and where you are. In just one click, we will produce your video and host it on BizLive Web. Let's get started today. The first year we had only about 500 walkers, we didn't even print walking tickets or nothing, we just had handwritten walking and uh, that's where the walk started. 
and over the years we've been uh, the committee has been uh, on the go all the time and uh, we never had a uh, one year must we've been continuous for 25 years I can't say it was a hard walk but it was a very pleasant walk and it's nice to get a good sense of Lanesia itself from the um, ground up as it were you know whenever I've come here it's been for an event so it, you drive in you drive out and that's that but this time I've I can genuinely say I've trodden the streets of Lanesia the race was okay everything was okay and then I wish they can organize this race every year because Gandhi work it was a work it was fight for us so that is why I came here to support it it was uh, it was very very nice very friendly very everybody in the area just took part in it it was fantastic this is the second time we joined it last year we did a 15 this year we went down to seven because not all of us are used to walking but we enjoyed every minute of it it was fun and really nice it's a privilege to walk and knowing that I walked for Gandhi and I didn't have my sandals on for Gandhi but it was a privilege to walk for Gandhi. That was a good race. Always tough. Uh, I've been doing it every year since I started walking which is about five years ago. We are very pleased that this year's walk has now really uh, uh, we've been very successful. Last year we had about 3,000 uh, walkers that took, uh, that took part and this year the numbers have doubled. I'm sure that it's, uh, the numbers are very near 6,000 and we are very pleased that people have come, board, come on board. And we've had uh, walkers from all different clubs and all different organizations that have taken part and it was a very mixed cr uh, crowd and that was very en uh, encouraging for us. Generations to come, it may be, will scarcely believe that such a one as this ever in flesh and blood walked upon this earth.